what's going on my motherfucking virgos it's your good sis lava the empress and for those who are new to my channel i give that spiritual tea and see what's going on in your life and what do you need to know right now this specific reading virgos is going to be based based on what is it that god is trying to tell you right now what your angels have been trying to tell you so without further ado let's get right into it but make sure you subscribe to my shit bro don't do me grimy or slimy actually subscribe to my shit and comment in the uh, comment section below of this video and let me know what resonates so without further ado leo let's i mean i said leo wow virgo you could be dealing with the leo but let's see what's going on in your situation what do spirit has what kind of messages do spirit have to tell you right now god tell me what messages do you have for my virgo Okay. they waste no time so some of you could be feeling a little fearful of taking a leap right now or holding back i'm hearing some of you um are deciding whether or not you should make a move or not but maybe you don't want to make a move i feel like you're just holding back and you're not really feeling riskful right now maybe you do need to take a leap of faith that's what's going to cause this new beginning but maybe you guys are scared of what that new beginning might bring so you're a little hesitant right now to take a leap of faith you're a little hesitant or you're a little fearful of you know what the outcome would be yeah you're a little fearful you don't know what the outcome is going to be and so maybe you're just a little hesitant whatever this is it could be dealing with a move or this could be a, a love situation or a work situation you take it how it resonates let's see for my virgos yeah, release your ex also in reverse. So some of you have a hard time releasing the past is what I'm hearing. Some of you have a hard time releasing the past because maybe what you dealt with in the past is all you know, okay? And so there's this fear here uh, of getting something new or having like a new beginning. Even though I feel like you desperately want something new, you want to take that leap of faith, but there's something that's hindering you back. Maybe it's due to the fact that you don't know what the outcome would be here and so you are kind of stuck in the past here and you're having a hard time releasing the past here let's see what other information what do you want virgos to know right now holy spirit they waste no motherfucking time thief here so somebody could be all right, so off the back, when I seen this, I heard somebody is stealing energy here. So somebody could be trying to steal your energy, just trying to um, just be careful who you have around. Somebody could have stole something from you or are trying to plan to steal something from you. So make sure you are being mindful of your bank account, being mindful of what's in your house or whatever, because somebody out here trying to be a little sneaky, all right? Um, and the way this person is all comfortable in the in the whatever room they're in, I feel like this is somebody that you know already, okay? This is somebody, look, they got their legs, whatever. But this is somebody that you know already. So just be mindful of who's in your energy because they're they're trying to take away from you and not give you anything back. That's what I'm hearing. So they could be trying to take away your energy here or just take away something that you have. Okay, maybe you feel like this person in the past has tried to steal something from you or or sabotage something that you have just so you won't be happy. That's what I'm hearing. Let's see. What messages do spirit have for you? Let's see. I'm just trying to make sure this. All right. What messages do Spirit has for Virgo? What messages do you have for Virgo, Spirit? Holy Spirit. Okay. Oh, wow. We have this in reverse. So we have excessive feelings of entitlement, rulership without restraint. So, yeah, this person feels entitled to you for some reason or some people feel entitled um to be in your energy and you gotta you gotta set the record straight okay they're not entitled to be in your motherfucking energy just because you know them just because they're not new some people try to use this thing of you know well i've known this person for years and years so they'll never leave me or they can't just you know 
leave me behind they'll never whatever the case may be like sh shut up okay this person is not entitled to to own you or to own your energy just because you've known them just because you are fearful of meeting someone new or having some type of new beginning here but what i'm seeing here is be just be very careful virgos let's get another card from this deck um just so that we are super clear but I, I don't like I don't like this person, whoever this person is, or this could be dealing with a situation with um your job. Maybe you are so used to being at the same job that you kind of find it hard to move towards something new. But whatever this thing is, it's taking away your happiness in a way, and it feels entitled to do so. So if it's a person or a job, let that motherfucker go. Period. Now let's see what else. Spirit wants to tell my Virgos. Wow, look at that. We have two that came out. Inability to grow up and be responsible. Extreme depend dependency on others for physical security. Yeah, I feel like um, whoever this person, and I keep saying this person, it could be this person, whatever. It's just really depending on your energy right now to take from you. So I really just want you to be careful, Virgo, of who you allow in your energy. And then we have the virgin in reverse, fear of intimate union. So this person is not even somebody that cares about, you know, how you really feel, your love and all of this. They don't really care about your heart, bro. They don't really care about what you really been through. They use that as a facade to stay in your energy if they tell you that. But this person has a lot of growing up to do. Or, you know, maybe if this is coming to towards you or if I'm directing this strictly towards you, maybe there's a need to not feel so dependent on other people's energy and there's a time to grow out of that because it's really, really hindering you from this new beginning that you that you deserve, that you are old. You know what I'm saying? New beginnings are great things. They're not, you know, something to fear. And I don't want to be a hypocrite and say that because I'm a Taurus. Shit like that is scary for me if it's a sudden change or I have to do something. But at the end of the day, once you realize that God has your back, you're not going to be afraid of any type of change. So let's see what other information I can get from my Virgos. What is God trying to tell my Virgos right now? What is God trying to tell my Virgos? Judgment. I understand that everyone has their own unique past and challenges. So because that came in reverse for you guys, I just feel like, yeah, um, people probably judge you for it or for the decisions that you've made in the past. And so that's why you're kind of fearful of making a decision now, or you are afraid to be judged in a way. So you kind of hinder your own progress here. Or if this is a, that same motherfucker that they're trying to use judge, you know, judgmental uh, words or whatever to keep you stuck, to keep you bounded to them. So if you know somebody and you tell them that you're trying to change, you're trying to move or whatever the case may be, and they are not happy for you or they try to tell you what you should do instead, be careful of that person. They're trying to keep you stuck in this past. They're trying to keep you stuck where they are because they have to steal in order to replenish what they don't notice is already there let me say that again people like this have to still in order to replenish what they don't know is already within them so don't get stuck into that energy as well Virgo let's get um yeah you could have blocked this person before or you might be thinking about blocking this person just don't tell nobody your plans right now, Virgo, is what I'm hearing. Do not tell anybody your plans. You know what you need to do here, okay? And release this energy of um, wondering what the outcome is going to be or being hesitant because you don't know. You won't know until you try. So let's get some channel messages. Channel messages. Okay. And let's get a green. I need a green. Okay. So what is it that spirit is trying to tell my Virgos right now? Let's see. 
I'm going to message you. So yeah, this it might be this person who motherfucking messaged you. I don't know, but somebody is gonna send you a message here. So just let me know in the comment section below what the motherfuck this person is going to say. Cause from then I feel like you would be able to tell if this person is really someone that's for you or in your corner or somebody that's trying to hinder your new beginning here. Uh, let's get this. Let's open up this pink one. Let's see. There's another woman involved. Okay, so listen to this. Like I said, whoever this is that's trying to steal your energy, they're a liar, bro. They're a thief. And they just want you when this other person is not around here is what I'm hearing. So for some of you, you could be in a third party situation here. Just get out of that shit entirely, bro. You have a decision to make. So like I said, you guys have a decision to make, not only with who's going to be in your circle, who's for you and who's not, but really, are you going to take control back over your life and make that big step that you've been thinking and contemplating on doing? Are you going to take that risk in your life? Do you feel like you deserve that happiness, that new beginning, that leap of faith? Or are you going to just stay stuck in whatever this is and continue to hinder yourself you have a decision to make your last message is it's up to you so what are you gonna do listen spirit not playing with y'all motherfuckers okay my spirit guys they ain't playing with y'all motherfuckers all right they're saying it's up to you so what are you gonna do what are you going to do virgo let me know in the comment section below what you decide make sure you subscribe to my shit this is your good sis lava the empress and bro i'll see you in your next video bye virgo